So we chose the theme. Now let's go back into WordPress admin. Again, if you um, need that link, it's yoursite.com forward slash WP admin, like this over here. Um, yoursite.com forward slash WP admin. Um, and so you just go there, log in using the username and password you created when you install WordPress. And, <coughs> excuse me. Let's go over here on the left in appearance, click the little drop down, click themes. As we can see, current theme is 2010. That's the default theme as we saw before. Let's click on the install themes tab. Here you can search through different themes that are available for free through wordpress.org. I already picked a theme I like from Theme Forest and I downloaded it. So, I'm going to go to where it says Upload. And now we're just going to select the file. Brand new .zip is the name. And click Install Now. Might have to wait a couple minutes or a few minutes uh, since it's uploading the entire theme to the server. And um, so I'm going to pause this while it's doing that. All right, so it's been successfully installed. And you're going to want to go ahead and click Activate. So that'll make it live on the site. All right, awesome. So the site's now using the theme brand new version 1.0. We may have to do some initial setup, but just for uh, the sake of fun, let's check out what the site looks like now. All right, so we can see the basic templates there, but we need to do a little bit of stuff like adding posts and setup and stuff like that so that it really, really looks like a site and it's filled with content. Let's get started with that.